Yesterday was Wednesday, the 21st, and when we count, we say 21, 22. So today is Thursday, April 22nd, 2021. Let's figure out how many days we've been in school. We need to add another straw to do that into our ones section. Okay. Now we know we're not close to 10 because there were just zero in there, right? So we don't need to worry about that. These will count by 100s. And then we'll count these by tens, because they're groups of ten that we did. And then this one we'll just count by ones, because it's just one. All right, here we go. 100, count by tens. 110, 120, 130, 140, 141. You've been in school for 141 days. All right, how many groups of 100 do we have? Just one. We need a one there, and that's perfect. How many groups of 10 do we have? One, two, three, four. So we need a four there, and that's what we have. And then how many ones did we have? Just one. So we need a one in our one spot. Great job from the zero. And now we have the numeral 141. Great job. All right, now today we're gonna do a new word family. Let's sound it out so we know, and then we only have to sound it out once. Here we go. Right. Ut. All right, now let's change the first sound. Now I don't have to make those sounds anymore. I know these two letters together say ut. Okay. J, ut, jut. Jut is actually a real word. It can mean like to stick out or something. So if you hear someone say, oh, that's a jutting out, that means it's sticking out. It's a cool word, doesn't that say it? Jut. Guys, let's look at two shapes. What is this? My cone, and this is one of my cylinders. This is our fatter cylinder, right? Okay. Now, how are they the same? They're both 3D or solid shapes, so when I hold them, there's space. Okay. They also both have a circle for a face. The cone has one circle face, cylinder has two circle faces, right? How are they different? A cone only has one circle face and then comes up to a point. This one has two and then it's rounded around it, all right? Okay, so they're just a little bit different. A cylinder doesn't have any vertices and a cone has this point right here. All right, I'm gonna hold up two dot cards. You tell me which one's more. This one's easy. Which one's more? Six, right? Six is more than three. That's really easy to see. Isn't it? Let's do one more. Mmm. Ooh. This is a hard one. Which one's more? Nine. Nine is more than eight. Good job. Mm -hmm. 